Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I'm Michelle with Prettiest Problem. And today I have another thrift haul. I'm so excited. I haven't done one in a while and I haven't been going as much. And I've been picking up like something here or something there. So it's not that many items. But I also have a few non-clothing items that I'm really excited about and that I wanted to show you all. So I'm just going to jump right in because it is 6 o'clock in the morning and I have to get my children ready for school in a second. So I'm going to try to get through this really quickly. So the first item I left on all the tags so that I can tell you all the prices. You know I only go to the Salvation Army on half off day. So <laughs> most of these things I've gotten for half off. This top, I'm not sure of the brand name. But it is a size medium and I just thought it was a cool top. It's a square looking top and the neck is like no neckline. It just like goes straight across. So that's why I really like this. This was $3.99 so I paid $2 for it. And it's just a nice gray top and it's like a sweater kind of material. The next top that I got, it was a short sleeve shirt. I don't know why I really picked this up. I just thought it was a cool kind of looking top. But honestly, when I put it on, I was kind of like, eh, that's why I say try on your things before you leave the store, because I probably wouldn't have purchased this. But this is just a Ocean Drive shirt. Um, it says Ocean City, New Jersey on it. I don't know. I just thought it was a, a cool kind of shirt. Um, I was actually thinking about putting this on under a blazer. That was really the inspiration for the shirt. But honestly, when I put it on, I don't know, I may still be able to put it on or under a blazer, but we'll see. This was also $3.99, so I paid two bucks for it. The next top that I got is from Pronto um, Uomo. I don't know. It says cotton cashmere. I think this is a man shirt the way it fits me because it's a large, but it's like really large on me. Uh, not really large, but it fits me nicely and it's a large, so it's probably a men's shirt. This was $5.99, so I got this for $3 and it just feels really nice, you guys. I love the color. I love these neutral nude colors and it's just a long sleeve sweater and sweater material is cotton cashmere, so it's really soft. I just really like this, the color and the feel of it. The next top that I got is a Ralph Lauren sweater. And I have been waiting to wear this for a while. I still haven't worn any of these things, so I've been waiting to film and I wanted to have the right prices. Um, I also got this from the Salvation Army on a Wednesday. So I paid $3 for this and it's a Ralph Lauren sweater. I really loved it because of the neck line and the button here. I just liked it a lot and it's, the color is really pretty, a nice royal blue color. And the material, again, everything Ralph Lauren, the material seems really, really just nice. You can tell it's nice quality. The next top that I got is actually a sweater. And I believe this is a men's sweater as well. Yes, it is a men's sweater because it's, the brand is 21 Men, an American brand. So I don't know if that's Forever 21. Probably so. It's probably Forever 21. But this sweater was so nice, I could not leave it. And it has the buttons and the, I love the neck on it, the neckline. And this was just a really comfy, cozy, I can definitely see this like a fall sweater over my clothes, go to work type thing. Alright, for bottoms, I actually, um, there's a thrift shop over by my gym that I kind of go in sometimes when I have too much time before the gym. And I got these jeans, these are Levi jeans and they're women's and they're size 16. And these were kind of snug on me, so I know Sister Girl needs to like get it together like ASAP because some of my clothes are like fitting weird and stuff and it's just, that's a whole nother story. But <laughs> these were really nice jeans. They are like practically brand new. Like you know how some jeans are like still kind of crispy? So yeah, that's how these feel and they're like literally, the person probably never wore them or maybe once if that. And I just thought, I mean, a pair of Levi jeans, you can't really go wrong with it. Um, and these were $3.99 from that thrift shop. I don't think they were half off. So $4 for a pair of brand new Levi jeans. It's a no-brainer. Okay, and then I got this pair of kind of loungy pants. At Target, they have a, a line called Gillian, Gillian and O'Malley. So that's where these came from. Um, these were from the Goodwill because it has yeah, the Goodwill tag on it. And I don't know if they were half off or not, but they were either six dollars. I believe they were half off because I don't think I would have got them if they weren't. So I may have paid like three dollars for these, and they're just like 
around the house loungy stretchy pants which, and then i brought this shirt it was a men's shirt and my intentions for it was for it to be a super oversized shirt that i can put some leggings on with i ended up not even trying this on because it just didn't fit me the way it that i envisioned it fitting it was just like a kind of kind of looks grayish brown like a charcoal brown color if that makes sense and just a regular men's shirt and this is from express a regular express shirt and yeah so that's what that looked like yeah when i put it on it just wasn't wasn't working how i thought it would work so that's it for my clothes and i got three pieces i actually got four pieces but one of them i left in my trunk and it broke um it was a teapot set which i was i don't know really where i was going with that but um the teapot kind of looked like this this is a vase that I got from Salvation Army and this was $5 and I got it for $2.50 and I'm thinking my thoughts for this because this room this room needs some help so I'm trying to figure out how to decorate this room we're gonna be moving next year so I'm not I don't know if I'm gonna invest too much into this room but for my beauty room wherever we end up next year this is gonna go so I wanted to spray paint this like a old gold kind of color because the room has white black gold and pink yes that's kind of like the colors in this room or what i want it to be so i'm going to spray paint this gold and sit it somewhere with some flowers in it i'm not the best of decorators and then i got another piece of decoration and this is a statue and actually i think it was like a 1920s well i don't know i honestly don't know i just really like the statue but she had like one of those feathers coming out of her head and it broke again in my car but this was $9.99 so I paid $5 for this and I just liked it. It's a black woman with a nice little fro. She just looks really pretty so yeah this is what I got for that. Five bucks and it's like a brass. I don't know if I can spray paint this. I probably could but it'll take away from the dimension with the black so I don't know if I really want to do much to this. I'll just sit it somewhere. And then last but certainly not least. I have been looking for a mirror for some time. I just think mirrors are cool. I like mirrors. Don't judge me. But this mirror I got from the Salvation Army as well. And it's just a little small mirror. This is what it looks like. And it has like some, it's like an older, it has like speckles in it from, I guess older mirrors kind of get like some kind of speckles in it. So I thought that that was actually cool because it has that antique look to it. So I may put it in the house somewhere else. But if I'm going to put it in my beauty room, I may spray paint it gold or black. Yeah, I'm going to definitely spray paint the outside of it if I leave it in my beauty room, wherever that ends up being. So um, this was $12.99, so I got it for about $6.50. That concludes this thrift haul. That's everything that I got. I wanted to say something else. Oh! <laughs> I'm on this committee at my job called the fish committee and so we do like little fun things around the office and so I my latest suggestion for us to do was a ugly Christmas sweater party kind of thing well I don't know if you've heard of the white elephant gift exchange so I I decided to combine the ugly Christmas sweater with the white elephant gift exchange and so whoever wears a Christmas sweater will get an additional turn to pick a gift so um that kind of put a spin on it so i told my fiance he was like you just want a reason to go thrifting and i was like like really that's just what it boils down to now i'm just some crazy thrift lady <sighs> well that kind of is where the idea came from but you know he didn't have to take it there okay we all knew where the idea came from anyway i just thought that it would be really cool so i'm definitely gonna thrift it i don't know if i'm gonna add some things to it so if i do i may videotape that and let me know below if you would like to see that whole ugly christmas sweater idea so i think we're gonna have the party on december 15th i'll i'll figure out something either i'll show you the final product or i may take you along with me to the thrift, thrift store to find an ugly christmas sweater so let me know below what you think about that and thank you for watching this video don't forget to follow my snapchat and i had a huge announcement so go check that out i will leave the link to that video below thanks for watching don't forget to subscribe and thumbs up follow me on snapchat and i will see you in my next video bye guys so with this 1000 subscribers i am so excited to announce the launch of my website that i have been working on for
forever. So, um, actually, I forgot to do my nose. Let's do that now. I'm gonna take this chocolate oil. 